Greetings from the Yerri Coast. This is Mad Chad. And this guy. And of course, Charity. Oh, okay. See ya. Bye, kid. Yeah. There's Mama over there. Yep. Let's wait. Oh. Let's wait. This way. Yep. How you doing? Yeah. Good girl. Stay with me. On me. There you go. Good girl. How you doing? Okay, great. Right, go. <coughs> yeah. So, anyway. Greetings from the Yerri Coast. This is Mad Shad and Charity and a whole bunch of other people that don't want to say hi. I make it a point to always say hello. <laughs> When I see someone, when I'm crossing, when I cross someone's path, it's a greeting, you know? Uh, this the way I am. Come on. Dirty. This way. Really? So, you guys thought I forgot, huh? <laughs> no, I was busy. Uh, we didn't even work, we didn't even have a lunch. Really, it was more like a show something in your face and get back to work. Uh, but anyway. There you go. Yep. So, there are still Americans trapped in Afghanistan. Yep, imagine that. And, a lot of stuff has come out. Uh, what's his name? Senator Mullen, I think it is. Uh, and the Centennial, Centennial Foundation. They've been trying to get people out, working to get people out. And sure enough, uh, Everybody that is trying, uh, the State Department, Department of State, well, you know, the Trader Joe administration, are in all the uh, friendly, uh, what they call lily pad, lily pad countries uh, surrounding Krapistan, uh, and they're literally forcing compelling and forcing those countries to not work with these uh, former special forces and and uh, other logistics and uh, resources that are being applied to get these Americans out and the stories are coming out you know there were people that died uh, men women and children three-year-old girl had an infection and uh, she was American citizen a, uh, her, she was American citizen by the way of green card holders, her parents, but, uh, Trader Joe denied her access, um, and she, she died. She died of the infection. Um, uh, yeah. So, uh, and also in other news, the, the, how can I say this? The SIA, <laughs> yeah, the SIA had a gate, something called the Liberty Gate, or the, yeah, the Liberty Gate, the Freedom Gate. It was a, uh, a secret gate at the Kabul airport, and that's how they snuck people in and out without anybody knowing throughout their, uh, their operations in, uh, in Afghanistan. And so, it appears that that's how they got their, uh, those spooky, uh, spooky army guys you know, with the D in their name, uh, that's how they got them out, and, uh, nobody else, after that, they, they did him out and closed the gate, that was it, check this wild area out, old birch tree, Come on, all-terrain vehicle. This way. She's ready to go up that. <laughs> I think we'll go this way. 
No, come on, no. Charity, up. This way, no, up. Hey, no, this way. Hey, this way. Girl, come on. Charity, come. This is actually kind of steep, but we're gonna make it. We're gonna make it. Go at it sideways. Uh, uh, uh. So, yes, there are still Americans trapped in Afghanistan. And this, the powers that be are doing everything they can to keep those Americans right where they are. Think on that one. Not good. Not good. Uh, but check out, uh, what's his name, Senator Mullen. And, uh, and the, I think it's Centennial? Centennial Foundation or Bicentennial Foundation? Centennial Foundation, I believe. Or Sentinel. I don't know. My brain. <laughs> My brain is fried from work. It's the strangest place I've ever seen you pee. Anyway. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Every day, never forget. Tell everyone. Talk about it. Make it a buzz. <clears throat> oh man, we're stepping it out. Okay. Yeah. That tells me we're she's done and she wants her treats. Or it's gonna rain soon. Yeah, it's gonna rain soon. Uh, I coming out of Cleveland. Uh, <coughs> it was raining already. Uh, so it's definitely gonna rain here in, in the suburban jungle. So, we're standing by for that. I do have my, uh, my trusty, uh, <laughs> uh, umbrella with me. So, as Charity would say, <laughs> every day, never forget.